In the antechamber of his private retreat, Sidious, dressed in a dark blue cowled robe, paced in front of the curved window wall. Vader stood rigidly at the center of the room, his gloved hands crossed in front of him. It appears you attended to our little problem on Alderaan, Lord Vader, Sidious said. Yes, Master. Fang Zar need no longer concern you. I know I should feel some sense of relief, but in fact, I'm not entirely pleased with the outcome. Zar's death could arouse sympathy in the Senate. Vader stirred. He left me no recourse. Sidious came to a halt and turned toward Vader. No recourse. Why didn't you simply apprehend him as I asked? He made the mistake of attempting to flee. But you against someone like Fang Zar. It hardly seems an equitable match, Lord Vader. Zar was not alone, Vader said with venom. What's more, if you don't like the way... Suddenly intrigued, Sidious moved closer. Ah, what's this? Allowing your words to trail off, as if I can't see their destination. Anger showed in his yellow eyes, as if I can't see the thought behind them. Vader said nothing. Perhaps you're not enjoying your new station in life, is that it? Perhaps you tire already of executing my commands. Sidious stared at him. Perhaps you think you're better suited to occupy the throne than I am. Is that it, Lord Vader? If so, then admit as much. Breathing deeply, Vader remained silent for a moment more. I am but an apprentice. You are the master. Interesting that you refrain from calling me your master. Vader inclined his head to Sidious. I meant nothing by it, my master. Sidious sneered. Perhaps you wish you could strike me down. Is that it? No, master. What stops you from doing so? Obi-Wan was once your master, and you were certainly prepared to kill him even if you failed. Vader clenched his right hand. Obi-Wan did not understand the power of the dark side. And you do? No, Master. Not yet. Not fully. And that's why you don't try to strike me down? Because I possess powers you lack? Sidious lifted his arms, hands deployed like claws, as if to summon and hurl Sith lightning. Because you know that I could easily overwhelm the delicate electrical systems of your suit. Vader stood his ground. I don't fear death, Master. Sidious grinned maliciously. Then why go on living, my young apprentice? Vader looked down at him. To learn to become more powerful. Sidious lowered his hands. Then I ask you one final time, Lord Vader. Why not strike me down? Because you are the path to power, Master. Because I need you. Sidious narrowed his eyes and nodded. Just like I needed my Master for a time. Yes, Master. Vader said finally. For a time. Good. Very good. Sidious smiled in satisfaction. And now you are ready to release your anger. Vader evinced confusion. Your fugitive Jedi, my apprentice, Sidious said. They are traveling to Kashyyyk. He tipped his head to one side. Perhaps, Lord Vader, they hope to lay a trap for you. Vader clenched his hands. That would be my most fervent wish, my master. Sidious clamped his hands on Vader's upper arms. Then go to them, Lord Vader. Make them sorry they didn't hide while they had the chance.